time for Wonderful, Wonderful Adventure Now Korea. Korea! The Goodbye Buchan Edition. gentlemen, we have a very big announcement to make. No, I'm not pregnant. I just know that everyone at home would Why like is there a, hey, you got a baby. You got a baby? No, we're not pregnant. That's not the big announcement. No. Big announcement is on Tuesday, we are moving out of Buchan into our new apartment in Seoul. Yes, I am very mixed about it because we've been in Buchan for four years now. Over four years. Over four years. We have a lot of memories. We've tried to move out of Buchan before, but we were just like, nah. nah. Like every time we tried, we just, we were too much in love with it. We've seen this city grow so much. Like so many things have changed so many things have been developed and we just love this city. So basically, since we're planning on having our business in Seoul, we have to move into Seoul first. So we did find an apartment. We'll be putting off an apartment tour next week. Tuesday, probably. I don't think so. Tuesday, no, we're going to yeah, be moving like actually this. Be <laughs> we will film it very soon afterwards. Yeah, so today what we want to do is take you to all the special places in Buchan and we want to say goodbye to them. It's been a very emotional week for us. I feel really sad to say goodbye to Buchan. Let's go. Na -na 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 -na. Stop crying there. But what the world needs now. I'm zooming on my side, watery it's eyes. Us two. I'm crying because I love you. We just have so many places here that take care of us for so long. Are you crying already? Zaki. We have our Ajimo Samgap Soul Shop and the Goringo Gui place in the. Japanese restaurant and 12 doll coffee and coffee lua and we have to say bye to all of them. I know we're not even leaving Korea, but still. Stop being a sucky sissy. I feel really sad. Jump out of the frame. Na -na 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 -na. very first day we ever stepped foot in Korea. We drove back from the airport and as we drove into Buchan over the bridge, we looked out the windows with our faces pressed up in awe and we saw the Hyundai department store and we thought to ourselves, Hyundai makes the apartment stores? Aren't they like a car place? And we were totally weirded out by it and it turns out we were saying Hyundai wrong our entire lives. What is it? How do we used to say it? Hey Hyundai. Hey Hyundai. Hey, right, everyone in Korea is like, what? Hey Hyundai, so it's Hyundai. Candy department store. Candy back with John. Let's go. Oh, you're still there. That's uh, very peculiar. Okay, so this is like pretty much one of our favorite intersections in Korea. This is now Uplex. This used to be called the mall. Hey guys, where do you want to go? Let's go to the mall. Which one? The mall. And right beside it is Candy department store. Anyhow, it's not the mall anymore. Now it's Uplex. And I always want to put another letter in front of it. Like, how about an S? Let's go to the Suplex. Hulkamania. It's gonna run wild. I gotta clean this. Is it better now? Yoo-hoo. And after exploring this area for a long time and having a child scream right beside me, he's got a career in camera, that's yeah. for sure. Uh, anyhow, after staying here, um, what was I saying? I'm gonna, I'm gonna take over here for a second because Simon went crazy. Our favorite tteokbokki stand ever is here. It's the one that's right over there. Are you making faces at me? Anyways, um, this is where our favorite tteokbokki stand is. It was the first tteokbokki stand video we ever made and we like described the tteokbokki. And after being in Korea for four years, we have never found a better dokbokki stand. It's the best. Are you still mocking me? Yeah, that's the dokbokki stand over there. It's kind of like anti up since then. They have like mosquito netting and they've added additional lights and all this other stuff. I'm gonna go here without you. This yachi twigum, definitely my favorite twigum. It's just like shredded vegetables. Thick and fluffy. Other yachi ones we have are always so thin and they get so crispy and burnt. This is just rich. It's like shredded vegetable bread. Mm. So we pretty much had duck book here right there. But this chicken place right here probably has one of my favorite memories in all of Korea altogether. Back during World Cup 
soccer time when we were all watching the soccer game together. It was Korea versus Greece. And when Korea scored a goal, everybody jumped up out of their seats. Everybody was cheering. We were cheering. Martina was cheering. I jumped so hard that I actually wound up kicking the table really hard and like busting my toenail. And it was like broken for like six months. After we were cheering and after we were happy, some people came up to us and brought us a big basket of chicken and beer for no other reason, just to thank us for cheering for Korea. And we were so touched. We felt like we were part of Korea, like really, really part of it for once. And it was really one of the most moving memories of my life. And I'm not gonna cry because I'm not that kind of person. Hey, go. The Green Tunnel, it's kind of like this bizarre landmark in Butchon, and we've always wanted to make a video scene from like K-pop Music Mondays in here. Martina didn't want to do a video of this place, but it's super special to me. Here's Home Plus. We did like 70 of our videos here. How could we not do a video here? I remember the first video we did here, but Simon doesn't. It had to do with the giant leeks. But leeks they were actually green and onions. And watermelons. And I held it up and I was like, this is bigger than my body and we had never seen such big onions in our life. You're not a real fan of us. You're not a nasty. I'm leaving. <laughs> We are in Vanilla Spoon. We've never actually done a video here before, but we always wanted to. It's located just behind Home Plus, so like a lot of people don't actually know that it exists. You did not just do what I think you did, Simon. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, guys. Uh -huh. Are you kidding me? You have no proof. That was the last Earl Grey cupcakes. You are in so much trouble. Please I tell me you're hiding this somewhere. I am a nice guy. I did eat. Whoa, more than Whoa. half of it. <laughs> My balance is gonna cut off. Here's your half. Put it back down. Sad faces. Sad. I eat my cupcake slowly on like one of us here. I can't, look how much he ate. One shot. Then me and their cupcake one shot in their Saturn head. <laughs> <laughs> We also made a video about uh, our favorite hair salon here, and so we're still gonna have to come back here from Seoul to get our hair cut. We don't trust anybody else. No, there's no way I can put my hair in anyone else's hands. Cherry, something mean, you are the best. If you were watching this, yeah. I don't think you watch our videos. Oh, we love you. Cherry, something mean. <laughs> this is the very first video we ever posted. Uh, we're here in Korea and we're enjoying our first meal. This is the Sundubuchigi restaurant that we went to the first time when we we're all like, Annyeong haseyo, I don't know what I'm doing in Korea. I'd be like, this is it here. So our old apartment was like right around the corner from here. Let's go visit our old apartment and visit Cafe Lua. Cafe Lua! Located below our old office hall. We were ecstatic when it first opened because it used to be like a chicken beer place and then it closed down and opened up to be another chicken beer place and then it closed down and opened up to Cafe Lua and we spent hours and hours editing videos here. Oh man, we're gonna miss it. Let's go inside. And like really the best mojitos and margaritas ever. Our old workplace. This used to be our office actually. Our, well, not official office. Our unofficial office. If you look closely here, come down here, Simon, come down here. Mm. You can see the sweat drops from where I was working and where my sweat dripped from exhaustion. Sounds kind of gross, actually. It's a rough life. This, ladies and gentlemen, is where it all started. This is our first office hotel in Korea, Pilio Park, Bidong. We lived in number 804. Every time we see this the place, hallway. we feel a warmness in our hearts. I remember Spudgy running down the hall here and coming out and 
pissing all over that tree. Uh, spudgy. I remember, I remember the time that Spudgy accidentally got into our rice supply <gasps> and he ate like two oh, cups of God. raw rice. And when we came home, he's like, I don't feel so good. We took him outside and he pooped like full sand out of his butt. I'm pretty sure it's like he elevated his butt. It was like a mountain. It was like a, it was like a mountain. It literally looked like he just pooped out pure rice, like sandy, sandy rice. Are and we really telling the Spudgy yes, shit story here? Yes, because it's probably still there. Yes. The sun has dropped in Buchan. And we are heading to our final destination today, Twelve Doll Coffee, which we spent more time in than our actual second apartment that we moved into, right Simon? Yep. We did winking challenges there, we did interviews there, we did like meet and greets there. It's just like, it's really a second home. Or like a first home with the second option of our, our apartment that we kind of lived in. I have a kitty. Hey Mimers. This is a tree where I make lots of foods. Yes, you do, Spudgy. You do. Did we mention that twelve dollars pet friendly? If you couldn't tell, Spudgy chills with us while we edit all day long. And this is our first time to take Memers there since she was a kitten. Remember we posted that video on the Open the Happy channel? Right. Kisses. Hey, Spudgy. Hey little guy, yeah. how's it going buddy? It's an animal party. What are you doing, oh, there's a puppy right behind you. <laughs> yeah, it's an animal party. What are you bad kitties doing here, memers? What do you have to say for yourself? Are you attacking this poor kitty in a box? Behave. Is this what happens when we invite you over? The guests? Tell me what you did. Oh. Mm. This is pretty much what we did. We would sit out here with our laptops with the Spudgy. So that's it for this week's Buchan adventure. That's really it, isn't it? This is like our last wank in Buchan. We're moving out of here. So next week we're gonna start exploring our new neighborhood and we're gonna be posting up new wanks and fap faps from an area that we don't know very well at all. And we should be settled in there by then. I don't know about that. I'm still gonna get Ooh. lost and have no way how to get home again. We could show you what our apartment's gonna be like. Apartment tour. I thought we already said we're gonna do apartment tour in the beginning of this video. You don't remember. I remember so little. It's like editing inception because I'm already starting to edit some of the stuff from earlier today uh -huh. and now we're videotaping and I'm talking about editing while I'm editing. Blah, blah, blah.